I am honored to be sitting across from Walt Heyer, author of a book entitled Trans Life Survivors. Walt Heyer, welcome to The Candace Owens Show. So you lived your life as a trans woman Mm -hmm. how many years? For eight years. Eight years. That's a very long time. When you begin to introduce these ideas that you can change your gender, change your sex, is you, you begin the early sexualization of children, which is abhorrent. It shouldn't be done. It shouldn't be allowed. We're interfering with their natural development. You actually introduce gender confusion or gender dysphoria. You're not born with it. You're not born with a different brain. You're not born in the wrong body. The transgender uh, movement is is really a band-aid for something else. And many people that find themselves in, in, in this trans space are really hurting. Every single person that I've worked with over the last 10 years, 100% of them can identify the issue, the time, the hurt, the pain, the loss that caused them to not want to be who they are and begin to identify as a different gender. The suicide rates of people that transition are astronomical. 19 times higher. 19 times higher. And our media ignores that. And Candace, they're even using the the idea that you can transition people as a suicide prevention. You know, they say this is a way to prevent suicide. It's nonsense. The actual surgical process, changing genders, is causing them to attempt and commit suicide 19 times greater than the general population. It is actually the hormones and surgery that is causing the suicides. (laughs) 